YouTube Zodiacs, what's good? What is your boy Cash the Gym and I am back with another video. This is day three in a row of the X-Men 110 scale by Iron Studio. So on today we do have none other than Sabretooth. Let's get it. I'm feeling lucky. You know like Luciana. Money, power, here, respect. I'm a thousand Lucky, lucky. I'm feeling lucky, nigga. Lucky, lucky. Unboxing of Saber Tooth by Iron Studios 110 scale. Uh, just to uh, read from the handy dandy Marvel Encyclopedia, uh, looks like Saber Tooth first appeared. Uh, first appearance is Iron Fist number 14 in August of 1977. Huh, that is crazy. Young Mutant Victor Creed, and as you guys know, he's very famous with fighting uh, Wolverine. So that's something to kind of look forward to there. Um, watch the movies if you guys haven't. Go ahead and watch them. So let's go ahead and dive into this unboxing. And as I'm getting this out the uh, casing, I'm very eager to know, is this one that you guys have in your collection? Is this one that you're possibly thinking about but waiting for a review such as this, an uh, unboxing? Um, me, myself, this was one that I definitely felt like, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get into the collection. You know, I definitely like Sabretooth. Ooh, that noise. That noise is loud. This is probably my least favorite part of opening statues, as I always say. Like, I just, I don't, I don't like opening this part. Just to show you guys real quick, that's how it is packaged, so not really too much. As you guys know with these, there's barely, there might be two, possibly three, most four pieces. So let's go ahead and get the base. Oh crap, wow. Oh yeah, this base is nice. <laughs> I can already tell you this is about to be a five out of five, just from the base, I can already tell you. Look at it, that's the sentinel hand right there. The sentinel hand. Yeah, that's nice. Look at the inside of the robot, like the the inside right there. That's that's nice. You have the sentinel hand, which is that's crazy. So let's go ahead and get this out here. So Saber Tooth, Saber Tooth, they put in some work for you, man. Oh, and just as I said, it looks like this is only gonna be a two-piece uh two-piece statue. Heck yeah, look at that. Look at the skull. Yep, it's like those ones. You guys hear, hear my son Noah back there talking. Yeah, so this is Sabretooth right here. The sculpt looks really good. Let me go ahead and put this in and then we'll uh, start analyzing it, see where he goes. So it must be like that, yeah, because his foot is like that. Let's see, get that down. trying to get his foot in here sometimes you got to angle him at like the right angle all right so here is Sabretooth 110 scale by Iron Studios from the looks of the Sabretooth um I really love the color of his suit it really pops and when I'm looking at the color of his suit versus the color of Pyro I kind of really wish that Pyro's yellow would have kind of mirrored his. It's kind of what I was hoping for. When I look at his claws, all those look exceptionally well. Uh, looks like I actually have one that has a chip of paint on it. So that kind of sucks. Maybe I'll just color it in with like a black marker so I won't notice. So mine does have a little piece of chip paint on his claw, which I really, eh, I mean, you won't be able to tell, but so out of the three pieces that I opened in the same day, the Colossus, the Pyro, and the Sabretooth, Colossus had dust on them, and Sabretooth has a little def little mess up piece on the nail. Um, looking at the eyes, the sculpt, everything looks perfect. I mean, it, it looks perfect. Yeah, everything looks perfect on here. I'm gonna, I'm still giving it a five out of five, despite that minor piece on the nail it looks it just looks really really good to me 
I highly recommend you guys getting into this line here. Um, the whole diorama is going to be amazing. The X-Men, Sentinel 1, 2, and 3. Like, this is just going to be amazing. Um, you guys probably see my cat back there, Thor. So leave in the comment section down below which X-Men of this 110 scale you actually own. Do you own them all? Is there one that you missed out on that you wish you could get or that you possibly look for in the future? Um, certainly let me know. And remember to like, share, comment, subscribe, and all that. It's your boy Cass the Gemini. God bless you, dig.